Hi guys, Dane here, and this is not a drill or a clickbaity title for a video. I am going to Latvia. I'm actually going to Latvia tomorrow. So, surprise! So this is part of a last minute opportunity that I've been offered to go to Latvia as part of a press visit. Basically, uh, Latvia and the Baltic are going to be the market focus countries at this year's London Book Fair. And so as part of that, they're doing a lot of work to try and promote Latvian literature and promote Latvian authors amongst the wider reading public. So I'm super excited to be getting involved and, and bringing the word to you about all these awesome Latvian authors that I will be discovering. There's also the Latvian Centre Centenary celebrations in 2018 as well. So there's a lot going on at the moment. So I was invited along to Riga in Latvia by the British Council Latvia and it's gonna be a three-day event from the 7th to the 9th of March and uh, I will be given, and this is a quote as well, uh, an insider's view of contemporary Latvian literature, which sounds fascinating. So obviously I'm gonna be taking my camera along and taking you guys behind the scenes with me. I'm also gonna be blogging about it on socialbookshelves.com and writing various bits and bobs and and pitching them out to various sort of both travel and uh, literary publications as well. So it's all very exciting. While I'm there, I'm on, I'm going to be honest. I'm probably not going to have a huge amount of time to actually edit videos and whatnot. But I will continue with my regular upload schedule, and then we might have like a Latvian week or something like that towards the end of March, where um, I can put out a bunch of different videos and go with a you know a whole uh, themed upload schedule. So keep your eyes peeled for that. So a few facts about Latvian literature. So over thirty. 30 Latvian authors are being published here in the UK in 2018, which even if that doesn't sound like a lot, you have to consider that there are 1.3 million Latvian speakers in the world, so it's quite an achievement. I'm not going to attempt to pronounce any of the authors' names at the moment because I will get them wrong and, and I'm going to learn them, so I'd, I'd rather uh, <laughs> save that for a later point. But I will link below to where you can find out some more information about the various different Latvian authors. There's a whole different range of styles and genres and all this stuff covered as well, so you're, you're sure to be able to find one to suit your interests. Now obviously, as I mentioned as well, there will be a big Latvian presence at London Book Fair, which I will be going along to, that's in April. So um, it is a paid event, but to be honest, it's worth it to go along just to keep your, keep your finger on the pulse of the publishing industry so I'm going to be going along to that as well and I will you know keep you updated with that too so so we have received an itinerary as well so I wanted to give you a few of the highlights on that so we're gonna have a welcome presentation by the Latvian Institute a tour of the National Library of Latvia which hopefully they allow me to film inside there for you guys we're gonna have a presentation on contemporary Latvian literature a guided city tour we're gonna to learn about the Latvian I am introvert campaign as well uh, dinner with Latvian authors and translators. We're going to go on a guided tour of the Museum of the Occupation of Latvia. Some more presentations, so on the Latvian book market, on children's literature, we're going to meet some illustrators. We have a meet and greet with publishers. This one sounds super posh, I'm going to have to make sure I uh, take a suit with me. This is dinner with the UK Embassy and the British Council, as well as Brits in Latvia. Hopefully you should get some time to interview some of the authors as well. We're going to meet, this is one of my favourite bits, we're going to meet the Orbiter Group, which are Latvian Russian speaking poets. And we're going to have a beer tasting as well with a local author brewer as well. So lots of exciting stuff happening. I can't wait to go. So my girlfriend also got me this super cute little Marauders Map passport case as well for me to keep all my documentation in. So shout out to Becca, thank you very much. So like I said, I imagine I'm not going to get a huge amount of time while I'm there to edit videos and post blogs and that kind of stuff, but I am going to be taking along a notebook and keeping loads of notes, taking along my um, camera and even like, I'm going to take my lapel mic, so hopefully if we do interviews, I can get some nice audio and stuff. But um, yeah, it's all very exciting. In the meantime, if you want to follow both my personal accounts and my book blogs accounts on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram, which I'll link to below, I'm going to be using those more as kind of you know an ad hoc thing to post as I go through the various events and whatnot so that'll be super cool and uh, yeah keep your eyes peeled for more on Latvia and some of the awesome authors that they have to offer a couple of other things I do want to mention in this video as well so I've already mentioned that while I'm away I'm gonna keep the regular upload schedule so you don't need to worry about that as, as if you're worried that I might suddenly stop posting videos as soon as I get back from Latvia I get back on the Saturday morning Saturday night I'm going to a concert to see a band called listener and then Sunday I'm going on holiday with my mom and my girlfriend. So there's gonna be a lot of traveling, but that also means that there's gonna be a lot of reading hopefully. So I'm quite excited about that. 
and um, I will also be doing a holiday video and all, all that kind of stuff. You, you know how it is. So, um, but yeah, that means that despite me not being at my house much, you should still get plenty of videos to watch while I'm away, so that'd be super cool. If I'm a little bit slow to watch other people's videos over the next couple of weeks, I apologize. I'm gonna try and prioritize you know, ones I really want to watch and then I might have to catch up with some sort of when I'm when I'm back to work, I suppose. The other thing I was gonna say is that I don't like flying. So I'm I'm not looking forward to the flight, although it's usually the check-in that I don't like. So once I'm in the air I tend to be alright. And I also haven't been on a plane since I read The Langoliers by Stephen King. But um yeah, all in all very exciting couple of weeks coming up. Like I say, it may mean that I'm a bit slow to reply to things and this and that, but I will definitely be doing my best. And in the meantime, I'll be taking lots of footage for you guys to enjoy. So yeah. So anyway, that's about it. I'm going to put as much info as I can in the description box below if you want to check out more on that. And if you want to check out some of the Latvian authors, I definitely encourage you to. I was going to try and do some highlights, but honestly, there are. I've, I've had a look through some of them and there are, there are at least sort of 40 or 50 different authors that I've been looking through and been like, well, that sounds cool. Well, that sounds cool. Well, that sounds cool. And um, I can't wait to, to see what's, what's, what the Latvian literature scene has to offer, so yeah. But anyway, in the meantime, if you've enjoyed this video, please hit a like. Hit a like for Latvia, come on. And um, yeah, subscribe to see more videos, including what I get up to on this trip. And I will see you soon for another bookish video. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.